Hello guys, welcome, welcome. Hana here again, and we are back to Pocket Mirror. So let's continue our journey to the dark hall. It's too dark. Hmm, I can't go there. Oh, are you sure this will be alright? Of course, my love. You are safe here. There's no need for you to worry. What about your family? That's different matter. It has nothing to do with us, my dear. What about your daughter? About her? What about her? Won't she suffer from this? I will be sure to take care of that issue soon. Now hush, my dear. Let us not worry about the future. Such an unpleasant conversation. There are people in there. Okay. Memoir of a young lady. Oh my god. The torn chandelier rests shattered on the floor. Its candles its candles are strained about. Whoa! But I can take one candle, right? No. Damn. I can't take any candles. How oh, dare you disobey me? What have I told you about leaving the room during the night? I'm sorry, father. This is the last time you will ever disobey me. Now get in your room and do not dare come out until I tell you. Do you understand? Yes, father. <laughs> Poor girl. It's broken wine bottle. bottle. The murmurs of a crying girl can be heard through the door. Whoa. So, this is the end of the hall, huh? Whoa. Where have you been? RPI, I, I have been looking everywhere for you. I'm sorry. I just heard a strange noise while you were gone. A strange noise? Yes. You didn't hear it? No, I haven't heard it. More importantly, are you alright, miss? Did you get hurt somewhere? <laughs> oh no, <laughs> I'm alright. That's a relief. However, you shouldn't go around by yourself, you understand? I... No buts, miss. This mansion can be very dangerous as it's very old. You could get hurt if you wander around carelessly. I'm sorry, RP. <laughs> it's alright, miss. I'm just glad you're safe and sound. I'm sorry, RP. I was just worried about you. Worried about me? Because that sound was so loud. And since you are... I am... Oh no, it's nothing. I just thought you could have gotten hurt. <laughs> There's no need to worry about me, miss. But thank you. Come now, let's get inside at once. I'm sure you're feeling tired. <laughs> yes, let's. Give me your hand. So you don't get lost. Alright. This smells fishy. RP, I can't... RP... Yes? Why is it so dark in here? Oh, I'm sorry, miss. There are no lights in this corridor and it's gotten pretty dark. I know the way. There's nothing to worry about. I see. Alright. Well, she's trying to do something to us. I bet. We are here, miss. Are you feeling, feeling alright, miss? My head hurts. You must be tired. <laughs> uh, yes. It will pass, don't worry, RP. Please tell me if it doesn't. I can make you some tea. Thank you, RP. Come, let's sit. <laughs> it's better if we talk. Whist whistle, sitting down. 
Where were you all this time, miss? Oh, I... I... I went to the floor above the one we were in. The noise seemed to come from above, so you shouldn't have gone there, miss. I... No, it's alright. I'm not upset. I was just worried about you. You don't need... Um, you don't need to make such an expression, miss. I'm sorry, RP. No, I'm sorry for taking so long to come back. Anyway, where are we? Oh, this is a simple reception room. Oh, I see. I'm so glad you're safe, my girl. Even so, you don't look a bit bewildered. I... I just like to ask you something, RP. Please go ahead. Are you the only person in this house? What do you mean? Oh, I... I'm sorry. I don't mean to scare you, but I have heard some no voices downstairs. Voices? Yes. I'm sorry, miss, but there isn't anyone else other than the two of us in this mansion. Uh, are you sure? Yes. It must have been your imagination, I'm sure. She's lying. I sense it. I see, you must be right. <laughs> you must be very tired, my girl. Perhaps you should take a rest. I have a few guest rooms available. Oh no. What's the matter? There is a bird missing on your cardigan. Oh, I'm sorry. I had noticed it was missing. Uh, I, I'm so sorry, my girl. I must have sewed it properly. I mustn't. No, I'm sorry. I was the one who lost it. I'm going to get a new button upstairs. Would you like to come with me? Uh, what if you say yes? Why not? Let's go then. Okay, let's just try. The pale doll sits on the display with a serene expression. I should go with Harpy. This doll looks familiar somehow. Hmm. It's a light here now. Why, hello there, Miss. What kind of see? Get it? Now, now, Pumpkin. You should know better and act like a proper adult. Just kidding. Canvas rests and used. This is so freaking beautiful. Whoa! What the hell? So, this is the same corridor as before. Okay. a save there. Oh, it's a, a old box. Whoa. The girl without eyes or without the left eye was her sister? Should go with Harpy, okay. Is she our sister? Is Harpy our sister? Hmm, so many questions. I should go with Harpy, okay. Whoa, so beautiful. Ah, fourth. Oh my god, it's so dark. Oh my god, is something is going to happen? But it's so beautiful.
something weird is going to happen. I'm feeling it. Wow. Harpy? <laughs> I apologize, my girl. Yeah, she's that weird girl. It seems I have gotten a bit ahead of you. <laughs> oh no, that's alright. I was just wondering where you'd gone to. <laughs> I see. It wasn't my intention to worry you. Happy, where are we? Tell me, miss. What is it? Do you remember this dresser? Uh, no, I see. Here, take a seat. RP? Yes? Is this dresser something I should recognize? No, not necessarily. I've asked you out of curiosity, nothing else. But if you ask me that then... Miss? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes? It's funny if you don't want me to, but... May I brush your hair? My hair? Yes. It's something I have been wanting to do for a long time now. Yes. <laughs> of course. Thank you. I'm deeply grateful. Well then, could you please pass me the airbrusher? Ah, yes. Oh, I guess this is a relic or something. This can be so fancy, RP. Is it really yours? <laughs> yes, it is. It was once given to me as a present from my family. I see. This might sound funny to you, but I feel like I've seen it before somewhere. Perhaps our mem memories may be coming back. RP, yes, what is it, my girl? Can you please tell me a bit more about myself? I can tell you about what I know. Unfortunately, it isn't much, but I hope it will satisfy you. I think we'll do. I mean, sorry. <laughs> please don't apologize. I understand your need to know, my girl, but you could please hang me the comb first. Ah, yes. <laughs> I'm so sorry, RP. Don't worry, miss. Now please sit it up straight and place your hands on your lap. Oh, oh, I see. Okay, yes. Just like that. We don't want your beautiful hair, long hair, to get tangled now, do we? Thank you, Harpy, for combing my hair. There is no need to thank me, my girl. I was the one who asked you if I could in the first place, anyway. You are a very sweet individual, miss. More mirrors are appearing on the, on the in front of them. Although you may have a few difficulties regarding some circumstances. What do you mean? You need to have more faith in yourself. You have come this far thanks to your own efforts, so it's time to start believing in your capabilities. I guess you're right. You may not think of yourself as such, but you truly are a very diligent person. No one but you knows what hurdles you may surpass in your journey, as well as your goals, your fears, and your own strength. RP, it's time you start pulling yourself together, my, my girl. No more hesitating, no more doubts. My mirrors appear. You must carry out your duty, regardless of the means. And the music is starting to be weird. Regardless of the consequences. Harpy? Enough running away. It is easy to lose yourself in your path and even I... <laughs> even I am nothing more than a cruel misunderstanding. Harpy, but you are different. You are more than your mistakes, you are more than your fears. <laughs> You are more than your duties. Yeah, they are all... Weird. It is time to let go, my girl. So, each girl... Uh, has some evil on them, uh, in them, but... The evil they have, it's probably... What they are worst... Uh, as a, a person, I mean... The other one lies, so she was mean because she lied. She told lies. This one is mean because of something else. 
you must give in you must or she is selfish or a person who doesn't accept others as better than her so she must be well anyway just my intuition I'll be with you and I'll protect you and I, I think Harpy is our sister's sister Harpy what's going on oh my god so creepy as hell <laughs> you are safe with me <laughs> oh it's her name bad ends number two blindness oh this is the ending we have got whoa so we are now going to choose to stay so if we chase harpy we are going to get the bad ending second bad ending of the game uh, which the first one is with flatus we haven't actually done but i can uh, upload a video about it um, so uh, it's separately just for the, the bad, in, bad ending that's alright, I don't mind I won't take too long <laughs> so please, be sure to take a good rest <laughs> yes, thank you Harpy okay we can go here Whoa. So beautiful. Such a beautiful tiny house uh, room. Oh, it's starting to appear. You have finally come to me. Oh, what the hell? This is what I'm thinking. So, someone murderer? Who, who are you? Her hand, it's without a finger. And that finger we saw on the first part of the, of the game. I have been waiting for you, Angel. What? What do you mean? I wasn't expecting you to forget about me this quickly. Is my name Angel? Yes, it is. But then, who are you? I am you, Angel. It's a shame you can't remember me. You see, we have a special connection. Like petals from the same flower, or so I, so I would say. You are me, Angel, and I am you. How? It was my role to find you, and now that I did, it's your role to complete me. We don't have much time, but please listen to me. What are you talking about? It's time for us to reunite, to be reunited. They have always tried to tear us apart, but now I have finally found you. Wait. Miss, where are you? You have to come to me. I am waiting for you on the other side of the mirror. Wait. You are not alone, Angel. I will always stay with you from now on. Every time you need me, just knock three times on the mirror and I'll come to you. Wait, Angel. Please, you have to trust me. And please, promise me you'll be careful. He's still out there looking for you. Wait, who are you talking about? I'll be waiting for you. Angel. What the hell? Where have you been? Harpy, I'm sorry, I just... I got into this room. <laughs> Haven't I told you not to wander by yourself? You could have gotten hurt. I, Harpy, I... There is no helping it, is there? I'm sorry I yelled at you, miss. Harpy, is everything alright? Was there always a big painting in this room? Painting? A painting? No, there isn't. What's the matter, miss? You don't seem too well. I... 
Yes, what is it? RP, is my name Angel? I'm sorry, what did you say? I, I just... You just what? What did you do? Who told you that? RP, I just... I don't want to hear any more excuses from you. Listen, my girl. Lies won't take you anywhere in this place. Enough is enough, and it's time your face... You face the consequences of your own acts. Playing house will not make everything better. Hiding won't make you invisible, miss. What are you talking about? I'm sorry. I got a bit carried away. I apologize. Harpy, I don't know what to do anymore. I don't know where I am or what I'm doing. Flat is gone and... And now I meet the strange girl and I... Who did you meet? She said my name was Angel and that she was me. <laughs> Your name is not Angel, miss. It's not? No, it's not. But she... That is enough. You mustn't meet the girl ever again. You mustn't trust her, no matter what she says. But why? Listen, miss. I need you to listen carefully. As I told you before, I can't tell you your name. And I can't tell you who you are. Or what you should do from now on. However, I can protect you from whatever is trying to hurt you. Well, was Fleta trying to hurt me? I don't know, miss. All I know is that you mustn't trust anyone but yourself. Do you understand? No. I don't understand this situation at all. I see. Shall I leave you on your own, then? What? I'm asking you, if you are going to walk away from this situation, you don't understand. Why are you here, miss? What have you come here to do? I, I don't know. I don't know. What does that tell us, then? Thing you want to know who you are. What's your name, miss? And what you're supposed to do. Are you just going to give all that up? Harpy, I refuse to protect someone who has not, no will to thrive. Miss, that is no longer my role. I... I am sorry, Harpy. I don't need your apologies. No! I mean it. I, I understand what you're saying, Harpy. I do not, I do want to know who I am and what I'm doing here. Please forgive me. I ended up pursuing you when it wasn't my intention. No, you're right, Harpy. <laughs> I can't sleep, simply give up. I'm glad you understand, miss. I need you to trust me. And I need you to stay true to yourself. That is the only way... You will ever find the answers to your questions. That is what I have been trying to tell you. <laughs> I am sorry, I, I went overboard. No, it's all right. I don't think you are trying to hurt me, RP. I think she is. Oh, thank you, miss. I think you are, actually. Thank you for trusting me, RP. <laughs> oh, no, it's nothing. I'm just feeling a bit overjoyed. That's all. But anyway, I got the button we needed to fix your coat. <laughs> Thank you, Harpy. You're welcome, my girl. <laughs> it's done. Thank you, Harpy. You're welcome, miss. Well done, shall we? Shall we go? <laughs> go where? I need to take you to a safe place. We can't just stay here forever now. Can we? Oh, I see. Let's hurry. This smells very fishy. Is something the matter? Oh, I, I'm sorry. I was just come now, my girl. I'm. You mustn't dawdle. I'm sorry. This sounds very fishy. Very, very fishy. A 
Okay, we have saved. No, the girl is still crying here. Let's see if there is somewhere else to go. Okay, we are going to... Back here. And see what... Oh, there is also a save here. Same thing as before. Okay, we have already checked those. We already take. We already took the item. Okay, we can go here. Third. Oh my God, Mr. Pumpkin, hello. Maybe it's just a lamp. What the hell? <laughs> oh my god! A faint light quickly pierces the wi window. Shall peeking through the torn up curtains? Uh, some I sense that we are going to sorry one touch uh, I sense something weird oh my god are you all right oh miss you won't believe what happened to me what happened I lost my precious rosary I absolutely cannot live without it. I have looked everywhere for it, but I couldn't find it. It's alright, miss. I will help you. So please don't cry, alright? Oh, thank you, miss. You're welcome. Uh, okay. This... It's locked. Oh, such a big house. It's actually pretty big. So cute. Oh my god, this is so big. Okay. Whoa, so many doors. So many doors. Someone easily gets um oh someone ge easily gets lost in here in this mansion. It's locked. I don't want to get too close. It's just a statue. Oh, I have unlocked it. No, oh, this is the, the crying. It's locked, okay. Cool. And what? No, there is nothing on the other side. Oh, there is... It was just the wrong way. Okay, let's try to open other doors. Oh, I can't seem to enter now. It's strange. Oh, it was from here, okay. Whoa! 
Okay, so um, we have already visited that one, so... Oh! It's here. Okay. Okay, we can go back. Don't not put the curtains. Desk. It's locked. Awesome. It's locked. Oh, it's locked? Really? So there is not, not so much places to go. So, we are going to end up the episode here. I hope you are enjoying this series as much as I am. So, thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Peace out.